usually if the person is underneath you and you don't have your control set up, you're going to have to fill that gap so you maintain the line of attack, striking. So there's generally going to be in close weapons, elbows and knees, which work when you don't yet have power. At least you can get some mass in there and you'll get some of that power going, okay? So elbows and knees versus punching and things like that. And or legs, low kicks, and stomps. Okay? So just a simple one I on me, I will get the guy here. Okay? He's he's here, and I'm gonna cut through this to break it. Boom. Then grab the head. Boom. So th that's what we're gonna work today. Maybe you hear boom. You're gonna cut it, pass it. Boom. Boom. Cut it, pass it. Boom. Either leg. Wherever your balance is, boom. Pop right there. Boom. Okay? Let's try that one. Pass it. Look. Boom. Right here. The cut itself passes. Not cut down here. The knife will cut your arm. So the cut boom, passes. Okay? Then watch my hips. To do, to do damage, they have to drive forward, okay? So my mass comes in. Because this, this was the problem, is I have a guy underneath me, and I don't want him underneath me. So when I do the strike, I need to displace him. Boom! He needs to be out of the way, okay? So you're on the head, but your knee shot has to still feed his center. Put your hand there. I'll just use your hand. Okay, boom. I have to be able to displace him. Boom. Yeah. So my hips have to come into the kick. Boom. Okay, into the kick, and I hit my full base. Okay. Oh, he landed here. Good. Boom. This low kick here. So, boom, boom. Then boom. This kick right here. Shin, instep, everything. Boom. Right to the head. Okay, let's go. Do you remember I told you there's like a lot to learn, okay? Um, you have to learn how to strike. The, the strikes are not just follow-ups, but they're looming threats that the person has to address. And it's the looming threat that sets them up for the pins and the throws. If there's no looming threat, let's just take an example, he can take his sweet ass time bridging the gap. Do you get it? And then you'll never get any kind of inertia going. So, uh, I, I'm here and I, I'm the guy and he has no strikes. He, he just knows his Kihon Waza, okay? And uh, I'm gonna, Oh, done, 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 done. All right, okay, try it again, noggin. Try it again, noggin. Right? Do you understand? That's, I'll never have to commit. I can do anything. Look, okay. His looming threats mean I can't. This is dangerous, do you see? So I have to try to, try to get past this stuff. That makes his deviations possible. You see, so he, he deviates up the circle. That's, go up the circle, dude. I'll do it. Here he comes. Whoo, you see? That little extra half inch when he had to take a, another turn up the spot. We'll do it again, right? Right here, boom, boom. Sets it all up. Sets it all up. environment. Okay? Everyone knows how to attack and you're not doing stupid shit. So, uh, come in with this goofy Jodan ski. Not even, that's not goofy enough. Go like this. Ah. 
No, I could do that shit. You see? I could do I could do this stuff. Go with me. We'll do it again. If you know how to strive, you know how to loom, you know how to thread, you go, no. Sorry. Okay? So, I have to learn the body mechanics of striking. And here's what I'm seeing. He's down on the knee cave. And you're like, here. Do you see? If my body goes through, boom. Do you understand? And then I saw the other below cave. No, no, no. Just pull the back. And I saw this. What's, what is that kick? I was boom and boom. That's what goes to his face. So if you're not throwing it, but your mechanics are there. Boom. You can see. Boom. Boom. of your mass with his mass, your mass against his mass, okay? Not here. Got it? Okay, go. Well, on this one, he is more here, and maybe even Trying to get up. Okay. Boom. Pop. This kick is going to be like a front kick, but I'm going to use my heel. So I'm just going to show it. I'm not going to kick you. It goes to the face. Boom. So it's got, boom, a stomp on it. So that there's, he's going that way. There's a downwardness to it. And there is a linear thrust to it. So boom. Boom, and boom, here. Kick through. And smooth your transitions out. It's not here. Keep the offense going. So, boom. Okay, let's go. So this this stomp kick is not a ball kick. I'm going to use my heel. I want to displace him. Okay. So I did I did the first one. Boom! Right, and his body's there. I'm coming in and. Do you get it? Do you guys see that? So again, watch your little dainties. It's boom. He should not be standing there. So we do it off the thing. I'm here. Boom. Boom. Not again. There's his head. Boom. Through. Okay? Try it again. Okay, so some of you are trying for it. He go and then the dude comes back up. So boom. Here he comes. Bop. Pass him right into the elbow. Boom, boom. So we'll kind of do it. I'm here. The grip's dead now. You get, he, he absorbed it. He absorbed it, you see? He comes back up. I'm gonna hit, and boom, pop. Boom, boom. Then, boom. which way is the elbow hitting him? Forward. Right, he comes standing up. Boom! This is 
where you're hitting it, okay? But you're bringing it first, boom, pop, throw. Boom. jacked up in GWAS and ended up in goofy spots and because you're martially naive you didn't know really what to do. Okay? So we're trying to show you, look, there's plenty to do. Okay? So one of the ones you ended up in was you jacked up Kaiten and the guy's straight. You see? So you have to reproduce the mistake. Reproduce the mistake. You see? Okay? Now, I don't want to bring him into this double leg. Do you see? So, go back. this arm is checking and this arm is checking. Go. Do you see? They're not just dead. And I'm not standing out here because you'll close the gap. Oh, so, I have my checks. My body's here. I secure the chin strap, right? And that's when I do the movement. I come back, pass, boom. You can even wait for some of you, some of your ukes were doing right and just kept pushing. Right? That was good of you. But your your naga started going go and they're like. So you can you can feed. Boom, you're here, he's going, and I feed that. So this move is close, close here. He presses, I feed it, boom. It's not Kai Ten Nage, I fucked up. You're not gonna get this. You're not gonna get it. Watch if I turn, I'm not in the right place. Okay? Because I was in front. Just like all your stuff, don't check his height to bring him out of check. This is all very low. He pushes. Okay? Let's go. Yeah, that's it. Crane your wrist. Okay, so 
another mess up that was happening was you're trying for Kateka Tama, you see? But then PK got their elbow straight. Just keep the, keep the spiral going, keep it locked, okay? I'm gonna use my shoulder and my forearm. I have an arm bar here. Why don't I use it on a spiral geometry? So I'm gonna bring you around. Yeah. So end up here. Boom, okay? Now, don't force him down here. Force him over. See? And then you end up in your kimura. So, you try this. You lock, keep it going. Boom. Over the other side. So, the line is here. Go to your head mount. Boom. because you did it all one-handed. So let's use the other hand. You see? The other hand gets in the katakatana. So you, you jacked up because you went one hand, he came over, okay, fine. Boom, we're here, drop down, boom. Let's do this. Boom, you went one hand there, and it's like that. Boom, drop down. So Uke has to do, has to take the opening, and you have to give it, you see, and arm bar, boom, and just pass it over and drop, boom, okay, let's 